It's Good Day New Mexico with Casey Messer. All right, maybe you've always wanted to start your very own business. Well, my next guest says there are five things you've got to do if you want to get it going. Here with more, Randy Lambeth. He joins me now. Welcome back. It's been a while. It has. Thank yeah. you so much for having me. You got back. it. Okay. Let's jump right in. Five credit hacks, or not credit hacks, but things you've got to do to get going on your business plan, right? Yeah. They, um, it was April 2006. I received a, a phone call from my mother. And she informed me that my little brother, who was a firefighter in Oregon, had been involved in an accident. Oh. And as a recently retired firefighter, I immediately called her back because I knew how serious that could mm -hmm. be. And I found out it wasn't an accident that my brother had shot and killed himself. Oh, my gosh. He was 22 years old. Yeah. And like 50,000 other Americans every year that kill themselves, the leading cause is... Uh, financial problems. Mm. And so shortly after that, I founded Fortress, which was America's first paid on results financial services company where we help people. And today I want to talk about how we help businesses get funding mm -hmm. because they say that cash flow is the lifeblood of your business. And when you run out of cash, your business is dead. 80% right. of business owners will fail in the first five years. Wow. And I say, those are the easy ones. Those are the lucky ones because 90% that make it past five years fail again. It's because mm. they run out of cash. Okay. So I recently wrote a book that's got dozens of hacks, including the five things that you must do to build a foundation to get funding. Okay. And the first thing is, is naming your company. Okay. And it's a lot like naming a baby. <laughs> so I know you recently had a baby. Yes. Yes. Yeah. And how long did it take you to pick that name? Well, I don't know if I'm going to be a good example here because yeah. I actually found this name when I was 21 and I didn't even have kids till I was 31, but um, I just loved this name for the longest time and I did, you know, sit on it and sit on it. And so is that, you got to really so think about it? it took you 10 it? years. I guess so, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so yes, and most people, what they do is they fail and they just name it something to like what they do or their industry. And the problem with that is banks, when they go to look up your credit, they don't pull your credit like they do for personal under a social security number. They type in your name, mm -hmm. and if your name is similar oh. to other companies, they're gonna reject you. Oh, okay. So for example, I recently applied for a loan, I got denied, and I called and I said, why did you get denied? Yeah. And, they, and they don't have to tell you why, but it was my personal banker. She goes, there's 147 other companies with the same name that are defaulted. So okay. you need to name it something about very, very nondescript. So I like using initials. Mm -hmm. You know, so like if I was gonna name a company for you, it'd be CM18. Because so, I look 18, thank you. Yes, I knew you, you were go. my favorite. Yes. You know, because that's the year you founded it, maybe, okay. right? Yeah. <laughs> so the second thing you got to do to build business funding is you have to incorporate. If you don't incorporate and create that birth certificate, that business doesn't really exist. Okay. So you got to do an LLC, an S Corp, or a C Corp. It really doesn't matter which one. Okay. And the third thing to get the funding is you need to get a domain domain name. So you can go to GoDaddy, pay sure. a few dollars, and by getting those unique names, it's easy, it's $6. Oh, you know, nice. last okay. year I bought a domain, it was $10,000. What? For this domain name. Oh, no. But it was the perfect domain okay. name. But if you name it after very short like that, it goes fast. Okay. The and real quick. Yes. Yep. Go ahead. Do we need to? Two they, more and I'm done. Okay, go for yeah. it. You go. Four, uh, you need to get rid of the AOL.com oh, website. Hotmail as well. Hotmail oh. as well. Because the bank will deny you credit based on that. And the fifth thing is stop using your cell phone. Get a, a Ring Central yeah. number. Get it listed with 411. If you okay. do those five things, you will get your business funded. Okay. Okay, and this is so nice of Rondi. He is giving away his brand new book. If you go online to RondiLambeth.com, put in the code, the promo code New Mexico, you can get a free copy of your book. Absolutely. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.